The African International Film Festival is the ultimate gathering of original storytellers and audiences seeking new voices in cinema and fresh filmmaking perspectives. The annual program includes dramatic documentaries, features and short films showcasing new creators, emerging trends in storytelling and cinematic expression from talent in Africa and the diaspora. The United States Consul General held a reception in honor of Nigerian and American film executives participating in the 11th annual African Film Festival. News Central's Bettina Nwili has the rest of the story. This year in its 11th season with a the theme, Indigenous for Global, the Africa International Film Festival, AFRIF, is exploring Africa's indigenous content and the key ingredients required to take it to a global audience. With the unstoppable advent of the big streaming services, it becomes imperative to deliberately energize the Indigenous for Global agenda to establish how local stories can reach and connect with global audiences. We're storytellers and we're telling the stories of our own nations. One of the, the things that we often have said about Africa and when we talk about U.S. policy in Africa, we were often talking about let's help our African colleagues and partners find African solutions to African problems. But that's wrong. We need to be talking about African solutions to global problems. Our stories need to remain our stories. They need to be very authentic. We have to find ways to make it global. In making it global, we have the value, we get the right funding, we get the right value, we get the right pay. And for me, I'm always looking for that point of excellence for us. Film as a medium first arrived in Nigeria in the late 19th century in the form of peephole viewing of motion picture devices. These were soon replaced in the early 20th century with improved motion picture exhibition devices, with the first set of films screened at the Glover Memorial Hall in Lagos from the 12th to the 22nd of August, 1903. The earliest feature film made in Nigeria is 1926's Palava, directed by Jeffrey Barkas, which was also the first to feature Nigerian actors in substantial roles. As of 1954, mobile cinema vans played to at least 3.5 million people in Nigeria, and films being produced by the Nigerian Film Unit were screened for free at the 44 available cinemas. The film industry in Nigeria is growing. I remember when it first started, when Nollywood came about in the early 90s. What it, what it was from then to today is astronomical. It's come a long, long way. And every year, we seem to be getting better and better. I mean, Indigenous for Global is exactly that. It's about local stories, local African content that travels, that the world can identify with, empathize with, um, you know, and just, I suppose, travel. According to a United Nations report about cinema on the African continent, film industries could quadruple their revenue to $20 billion and create an extra 20 million jobs in creative industries. Now is definitely the time to make hay while the sun shines. Bettina Mwili, reporting for News Central.